Um, so, as we can tell, um, I've been crying, and I usually don't do these kind of videos, um, but I, I'm kind of having, like, a mental breakdown where I'm at the stage of, like, I don't feel like I'm going anywhere in, like, in general, in life, and, <laughs> you know, that's a really scary thought for me, because I want to do stuff, and I want to, you know, like, I feel like I can't even get a job. You know, I, I feel like I can't do anything right, and I feel horrible because my grandma's always buying me stuff, you know, and I can't pay her back, <laughs> and it's not like I'm not trying, because I am, I really am trying, <laughs> you know, and I just... <sighs> God, I really, <sighs> I don't even know, I just, <laughs> I feel like I'm not going anywhere, and I feel like, <sighs> like I can't even try and, you know, You can't have a relationship, you know, because I'm so scared. I'm so scared that I'm gonna fail, or I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna let someone down. And, you know, like, I feel like I'm just... I feel like I'm so scared that they're just gonna walk away again one day out of nowhere. And then I'm going to have to go back through all that pain and try and find myself again and try and find the strength, you know, just to get out of the house again. And I mean, I don't even know. And I feel like that's holding me back. Because I'm not doing things I usually would do. I'm not, you know. I don't know. I just feel like I can't do it anymore. I just. And where all this is coming from because I, you know, I was depressed after Joey left and I tried really hard. You know, I tried for six months constantly <laughs> to uh, get him back. And, you know, that, that was the hardest thing I've ever done in my life. And, uh, and then I met William, and everything turned around, you know, <laughs> and I was happy again, I was smiling again, I, you know, I can get out of the house. I have someone to miss when I'm not around them. Like, I just... I don't know. I mean... I 
pigeons. I guess what I'm trying to say is I'm afraid of failing, of failure, to fail, and so on and so forth. And you know, I mean, and I'm scared that the anxiety or my depression or all of this is just, you know, gonna scare when I'm away even more and I don't want that to happen. I don't. I mean, since William came along, I don't even think about Joey. I don't. I don't even feel anything towards Joey anymore. And I like that. That's something that I've wanted for a long time. And that's why all of this is just so confusing. But I guess I shouldn't ramble on all night. Um, I really hope I don't get any hateful comments. Because not being a drama queen is just kind of speak what's on my mind, and I wasn't even going to upload this, but I might as well, you know, but, uh, I, I got a lot off my chest, and I kind of feel better, you know, I still feel, I still feel like I'm failure going nowhere, but, So I guess I'll just leave the video here as it is. Um, yeah, so I'm sorry for you guys having to listen to my complaining and all that stuff. Um, while I'm here, I might as well do a really really, really quick update. I'd show you my eye now, but it kind of looks weird because I've been crying, but anyway, um, my eye's doing better. Two of the stitches have, stitches have already dissolved, so, uh, actually, I'm not gonna, I'm just gonna do an update tomorrow, I just and even try and be positive right now. So, but anyway, again, thank you for listening. Um, please no negative comments, otherwise I'm just going to disable them. Because, whew, you know, I'm just getting things off my chest, so that's why I'm not a trauma queen. But, anyway. <laughs>